Hello, hello, welcome to this uh, new video. Today we're going to be talking about Meraki Wi Fi SSID availability. And um, the reason for that is because when you create SSIDs on the Meraki cloud platform, by default, they are going to be broadcasting out of all the access points that you have com that you have configured in your network. Uh, in most, or I would say, in some deployments or in most common deployments, um, it is a normal thing to do. You would like to create maybe one or two SSIDs and and have them available anywhere in the company where you have access points broadcasting the radio signal uh, but sometimes that is not the case uh, there are many reasons why you would like to not do that and when it comes to um, spectrum management security administrative reasons and so on and so forth you may want to um, not allowed uh, some access points to broadcast certain certain SSIDs. So uh, the uh, the way for you to do that, you would go to uh, wireless in your management console. As you can see, I have four SSIDs down here that are enabled. Um, if I go to wireless, then I go to SSID availability. Uh, if we wait one second, from here you're going to have the options of selecting the SSIDs that uh, you want to work with, right? Uh, let's say, for instance, if I have this SSID, and then you have the option of uh, advertise this SSID publicly, or if you want to hide the SSID, you can hide it, and you also have the option of selecting the access points where you would like that SSID to be active, right? So you would come here, you select some access points, and then you will add the uh, access points or, or tag the access points that you would like to have that SSID being broadcasted from. Uh, something that you have to keep in mind is that if you hide the SSID from uh, broadcasting, uh, it is um, it's not a real security feature that you're going to enable. Uh, and number two, uh, you're still going to have you're going to have Wi-Fi traffic uh, from that SSID even if if users don't see it because what is really happening there is that uh, Meraki does not broadcast the SSID name in the beacon frames. So you're still going to have a lot of management frames uh, traffic even with hidden SSIDs. So um, that is how you do it in the Meraki uh, Cloud Management Console. I hope it helps. Have a great day.